I'm Terry Moran in Washington. We begin on ABC News Live with some breaking news, and it's sad. Liam Payne, the former member of the boy band One Direction, has died. Police have confirmed this to ABC News. The 31-year-old pop singer was found dead by paramedics in Buenos Aires, Argentina. Police say he fell from the third floor of his hotel in the neighborhood of Palermo there. ABC News contributor and Sirius XM host Mike Muse joins me now. Mike, what's your reaction to hearing the news, uh, the sad news that Liam Payne has died? Uh, it's a very sad day uh, for pop culture, for the music industry, and fans of One Direction, better known as 1D. Uh, One Direction, when they came out, became one of the biggest boy bands of all time, and as a result has birthed so many incredible solo careers, such as Liam's, uh, Harry Styles, and Zayn Malik, very dominant on the chart. Uh, Liam was one of the heartbeats, if you will, in the soul of One Direction, as he was one of their main songwriters, and the power of his pen in being able to express emotions, but it's also, too, a, a sad tale in terms of uh, sometimes they would say the price of fame, and we are very aware that he did struggle uh, with addiction, um, and one could say did he ever was able to get a hold of it, um, and he has demonstrated um, some unique and erratic behaviors over the last couple of years, um, and so it's, it's very troubling to see um, how his life has come to a tragic end uh, today, but we definitely remember the great music uh, that he has left us in song and words um, and with this group One Direction.